made it to the chip shop and is in the queue. So I've just had a walk up into Wells, had a drink or two at the pub, sat out on the front, just doing a bit of people watching watch the world go by this is a place i've wanted to come to for a number of years now and never actually got here so i'm really happy to be here so the tide's just come in really so when we arrived at lunchtime today there was no water the boats were just on the seabed or the harbour bed now, as you can see, it's quite full. Well, this is just at the top of the road there. It's a nice little trek down here. Well, it does seem that the train that used to run down the side of Beach Road has disappeared. All the tracks been taken up, which is a real shame because I was looking forward to going on there. Back to the train, this is what they seem to have now. It's just coming along the road. Bus. Morning guys, it's Thursday morning and it's a complete contrast of a day to what yesterday was with the glorious sunshine and 30 degree heat. It is absolutely throwing it down. It's rained since about 2.30 this morning. We've had horrific lightning and thunder all night, some torrential downpours. So we're sat out in the quest cooking breakfast in the caddock. There we go, we've got the caddock, breakfast, bacon, egg, black pudding for Andy and it's absolutely siling it down again. So we're going to just go have a wander down the pathway towards the beach. I think it's quite high tide now so I don't think we'll get onto the beach very much and I don't think we can take Abby on at this end anyway I think we've got to be further up but I just wanted to see the beach huts so we'll go on and have a look so just over the road there there's a massive car park quite empty today yesterday it was absolutely chocker you couldn't get in there at all shows what a change in the weather does for people so just again over there that's by the car park there's a beach cafe I've not been in there. I don't think I'm going to get chance to because we're moving to Inkledra Fields tomorrow. We only really had the one full day here. Wow, so we've made it to the beach. We found a place where we can fetch Abby on. There's all the different coloured beach huts behind me here. Abby's pulling my arm off because she thinks I've brought a ball and I haven't. So it's absolutely beautiful. It's a red and yellow flag flying today, so we'll be a bit careful. There just seems to be hundreds and hundreds of beach huts. got to say I think this is some of the softest sand I've ever walked on it's lovely it feels lovely between your toes <laughs> <laughs> 